He says we need strong borders, law and order. Oh, the horror! Men are lonely, suicidal. Oh, if only we'd read our Bibles, we need a revival from antiquity of that toxic masculinity. When the Israelites murdered the Midianites on behalf of their divinity, they responded with brutality to Midianite hospitality. They burned and plundered cities with no pity, acted shitty, and they divided all the spoils, donkeys, cattle, sheep, and virgins. The priests, they got their share, and Moses did the urgent. Joshua David Hawley shakes his fist at the world, then he runs like a girl, insecure about his masculinity. He projects his neurosis with the words that he hurls. He says that men are warriors, lawyers, breeders, and exploiters. Men are kings, husbands, and fathers who must give themselves for others. He cites Abraham, who didn't give a damn about the mother of his first son Ishmael, a lovely piece of tail, his wife's slave, whose body she gave when she was old and frail. But when she was 90, Sarah gave birth to Isaac, a hearty party with lots of circumcising. All of Abraham's slaves gave their foreskins that day. What could be more exciting? When he was an old fella, Abraham married Ketchula and was inclined to have more concubines. He could jive alive till he was 175. Joshua David Hawley shakes his fist at the world, then he runs like a girl, insecure about his masculinity. He projects his neurosis with the words that he hurls. Now he's selling a mug that features his mug, raising his fist like a thug, says he has no fear. You can use it to chug liberal tears and snigger while you trigger those minority-loving welcome liberals into a frenzy. But we just shrug. The boy needs a hug. Or a slug. Maybe some drugs. Joshua David Hawley shakes his fist at the world, then he runs like a girl, insecure about his masculinity. He projects his neurosis with the words that he hurls. Blessed are the poor in spirit. Blessed are they that mourn. Blessed are the meek. Blessed are they which do hunger and thirst after righteousness. Blessed are the merciful, blessed are the pure in heart, blessed are the peacemakers, blessed are they which are persecuted for righteousness' sake. Blessed are ye when men shall revile you and persecute you and say all manner of evil against you. Joshua David Hawley shakes his fist at the world, then he runs like a girl, insecure about his masculinity. He projects his neurosis with the words that he hurls.